That nagging cough or congestion, more than a minor inconvenience, it could be a symptom of a major health condition called COPD. Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, which is COPD, is basically a chronic condition. It's a preventable condition and it's a treatable condition. And what it refers to is airflow limitation. Dr. Sagar Nayak is a pulmonologist with Lee Memorial Health System. The average duration that somebody with COPD spends in a hospital with an attack is probably around five days. One of the most common reasons for hospitalization, COPD is often overlooked because symptoms are similar to other health issues. So when they first occur, people may ignore them. Severe symptoms of COPD don't often manifest themselves until the decline in lung function has reached such a critical point that the patients are no longer able to comfortably breathe. COPD comes with a collection of respiratory symptoms. Some call it a mix of emphysema, asthma, and chronic bronchitis. Early diagnosis and timely treatment are crucial in controlling the condition. Many patients with COPD will develop shortness of breath, chest tightness, coughing more than usual, producing more phlegm than usual, more anxiety related to the inability to breathe. Long linked to smoking, one thing you may not know about COPD is that more non-smokers are falling ill. It's now starting to become popular to believe that environmental pollution, smoke from factories, smoke from mines, burning wood fires, these things probably have a, a big role in developing COPD in non-smokers. Lee Memorial Health System offers both management programs to help people understand their condition and a transition program to educate patients from hospital to home. Efforts to improve care of this breathtaking disease. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.